What's up, gamers? Gamer on wheels, rolling in, presenting you some GTA 4 footage of me dying. <laughs> yeah, just kidding. No, actually, yeah, of me dying. Um, this video was going to be about uh, about the new consoles coming out. Um, and yes, I did cancel my PS4 pre-order at Best Buy. But like I said, this video was going to be about the new consoles. How how it's you know how I think it's a waste of money right now to buy a new console of the new generation because a lot of the games are on all platforms most of them but instead i wanted to talk about the state of my channel um if you i mean if, or a lot of you have noticed that i don't post a whole lot of videos as much as i used to and the reason why is i feel like i've lost my creativity uh in terms of uploading videos and commentaries and things like that um, you ever have you ever worked on something so hard that you felt like you you put a lot into it and you just feel like you've just lost your drive to want to do it? I'm sure a lot of you have, have felt that way before. And I'm not trying to be negative, you know. I'm not asking for a pity party. You know, oh, poor pitiful for me. My channel hasn't done well at all in the last year, but I'm not going to do that. I mean, I'm a positive person, but um, I've been doing this solely as a hobby. At first, I'll be honest with you, I was trying to make money. Like with Machinima or whatever, posting videos and things like that. But I knew in the back of my mind when I first started doing this about two years ago that the market was going to get saturated with people posting gameplays and stuff like that. And lo and behold, you know, my prediction was right. I've never said this in a video before, but my prediction was right. That, the, that there was going to be so many commentators up and coming that it was going to cause it to where people were going to lose out. So and that's what happens in any business. If something is oversaturated in a certain business, it's doomed to fail. I mean, that's just how it is. I mean, you can still make money off YouTube, but it's really hard nowadays. Because, I mean, if you're not entertaining enough and... You're not consistent enough about posting videos. You might as well forget it. You're not going to be able to make anything out of this. And, um, you know, I, I really wish I had more people to play games with. Because I've really been recording stuff by myself. I mean, a lot of the stuff I recorded is not people that I play, ga play games with. I mean, I've posted Call of Duty, but it's I'm not playing with anybody that I know. I mean, you know, like on my PS3, I had... Quite a few people that I played with uh, played, you know, a lot of the Call of Duty games on the, you know, on the PS3. But what I was going to say is, I, I really get entertained by watching like videos by like by Eat My Addiction and Hutch and Sark and Scene Anners them of them all playing a game together and they're all having a conversation while they're playing a the game and I think that's really neat. I mean, that's like bouncing off creativity uh, with each other. And, you know, coming up with funny stuff to say while they're playing the game. And, you know, I'd really like to be like that. But, you know, there's not that many PC games that you can find a lot of people that want to play. Because, uh, for example, you know, some games like Homefront. I mean, I don't know why you probably don't play that game. But on the PC, it's dead. There's nobody to play, on, play with. And I think I've heard, like, on the console, not so much either. But, you know, some of these games just don't have a, a, a following anymore I mean you know like I said you have to find a bunch of friends that want to play the game and they have to have the game too and I think it's just, that's the same thing on the console but it just seems like there's more people on that play on the console that play on the PC I mean don't get me wrong I love playing on the PC it's just hard to find people to play with and again I mean I'm not trying to make anybody feel sorry for me that you know, try to make you play games with me, but it's just really hard to to find people uh, that want to play on Steam. Um, it's just, I mean, just for me, it just seemed like uh, it was a whole lot easier on the console than on the PC. But you know, like I said, you know, there's some games that are dead. I mean, look at Call of Duty Four on the console. There's still a following there. I mean, even the other previous Call of Duties, even Modern Warfare Two, uh, have a have a following. I mean, and they still have a lot of people that play that game. But, like I said, I just feel like that I need to do something more. Or, 
I don't, I don't know what, or, or this, this channel is doomed to fail. Or should I just dump this channel and start a new one? So let me know in the comments below. Uh, I'm asking other YouTubers this question. When do you come to the point and realize that the channel that you have is you're, you're either ready to quit or should you start a new channel? What's the best thing here? To start a new channel or just quit altogether? Because I'm not getting any more subs. Um, I mean, I got a sub like last month, one sub. <laughs> and I've only got you know, a little over 500. So, I mean, if, if any of these, any other YouTubers are watching this video, please let me know in the comments below what your opinion is on this. Because I would really like to know. Either should I start a new channel or just quit altogether? So... I hope you enjoyed this video and this is Gameron Wheels rolling out.